Hey guys, welcome back to the Purity Moses and Family TV. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel guys today's video we are making a car guys today is saturday the perfect day to make a car as you can see there is no car with tart beans this beans is washed and clean the most difficult part of me making a car is washing the beans i don't like it at all <laughs> because it takes a lot of time it takes a lot of time so guys, beans, akara doesn't need much to make it, so you just have to know how to do it. So if you are interested in washing it, in knowing how to fry akara, keep on watching guys. <laughs> Even if you know how to fry it before, watch how I do my, how I make my akara, okay? Because we can learn from each other. So there might be a part that you are missing in frying a kara. There might be, yeah, this is the perfect way, as I know, of making a kara. Let's do this together, guys. So, guys, we are about to blend the beans now. I'm just going to show you this. I used this before. I don't know if you guys have used it. When I made this a kara before, I used this particular one. This was already washed one in a... In Africa shop that I bought it wasn't good at all it didn't taste nice so that's why it took me time today to wash the fresh one the beans and then soak it and wash it but my advice for you guys is when you want to make beans soak it the night before the morning that you're going to make it if I knew I, I should have done it that way because it, it took me time today I was I was about to change my mind to, to eat something else, but I'm really tasting of this. That's why I keep, I said, let me just do it. So guys, we are starting by blending the, the beans. So what's in here is, as you, see, as you can see, the beans, the washed beans and a red paprika and some onion. Um, Akara doesn't really need much things. Some people will add the uh, crayfish, but I can add crayfish to Oh, moi moi not akara. I don't know. We cook in different ways, guys. So it's starting with blending. Blending this, okay? And when blending meat, please don't add too much water. Remember, this is not um, this is not moi moi. This is akara beans cake. This is akara. So you add little water, so it, it can be. It doesn't look watery when frying it. So I'm just going to put everything in here and add a little water. And if you add little, you need more, you will know when you need more meat. So so guys, it's blended. And I just have to transfer it to the bowl. To transfer it to this bowl. As you know, I cannot add water to it, so I have to use a spoon to bring the water. I have to use a spoon to bring it out instead of wasting it. I was going to add more beans to it, thinking it's not going to be enough. This is really enough. Guys, this bowl, I love it so much. This bowl, I don't know if you if you notice when I used it last year to make, uh, I think, to make I use it to make when I hold out the tire. I told you guys that I bought it from Amazon. I bought it from Amazon. So good. So the boy is for me. The boy is so cute. <laughs> it's 
so portable. This wooden bowl. So so portable, guys. I love it. <coughs> the next thing is before frying the akara. Before frying the akara, guys. Okay, we have to slice some onion. I'm just on just we have to slice some onion to dice it. For, <coughs> for me, I like a lot of onion in my yeah, you just dice it. I like onion in my akara a lot. I don't know about you, and a little bit of pepper. Okay, guys. I just, I just add this, this one here. A little, uh, dice, uh, what's it called? Dice, uh, Paprika, uh, uh, no, not paprika, guys. Scotch bonnet pepper. Just mix. So you put, like I said before, beans doesn't really need much. You can add um, mangi if you want, or you just put, uh, you just put salt, salt to taste. That's very very important thing. Because if that's salt, you can't feel what you are eating. I say no. Guys, I just use the auto tomato tomato seasoning cube and have it to eat. Like I said before, it's totally choice. You cannot add um, like I said, some people add what is it called? Some people add uh, crayfish. For me, I don't like crayfish in my cara. I can manage to add crayfish to moi moi, but I like using uh, um, a lot of onion, a lot of onion, and uh, just salt and cube seasoning. So, and uh, some people don't like when they when the akara is like when the color is like this. So it totally shows again if you don't want to blend anything along with your akara. It's your choice, guys. It's your choice. So if you don't want to blend like red paprika to your akara, it's choice, guys. Even the one we eat, uh, we eat back home. Some people they don't eat the akara. It, it's white inside. Some people don't use uh, paprika. Why some do use as well? It's always good for you, guys. Anything you know that is best for you, you do it. My own is for it to taste good. For me to enjoy eating it when I'm eating it. You taste for salt, guys. You taste for salt. That I just did. Maybe I will, I would like to add more. You miss. You see the way I'm missing my I think I'll have a little salt to it. Miss, miss, miss. It's the missing that is the color. Otherwise, of course, it will taste differently. So, let's start the first batch now. Let's start the first batch. So, I'm starting the first batch now. You see that I didn't have much water. You need a lot of oil to fry this. A lot of whether you are using palm oil or um, olive oil, any kind of oil you choose to use, you need a lot of it. And again, guys, you reduce the heat of your of your gas, so it will be very cool. 
other way it will not be done. You reduce the heat of your gas. I like to drop little little one inside. What they call Jara then? <laughs> Jara Baku. They call it Jara. Is it that? Madam, put Jara now. What you bought is not enough for you. It's Jara that will not be enough for you. Hmm? Some, some madam will say, What you bought is not enough for you. It's Jara that will not, not, that will not for your belly. Hmm? Who sent you? Who sent you to come and buy again? They have to know the person before they push her. I don't know why they always ask that question. Who sent you? Uh, it's my mom. Oh, who is who's your mom again? You have to like do exam for them to have. <laughs> who are you blaming? Is it not you that asked for Jara? You asked for Jara now. Meanwhile, that Jara, before you get home, you're going to eat from me too. Not all of it because they will definitely know at home that the, the person you bought it from Pujara so you have to you, you, because you want to eat from that jara I'm exposing myself guys then I ask for it and then they start questioning you why jara buy more then you reduce the gas of the the heat and mm -hmm. the when when one side is well cooked you flip it. You flip it for the other side to be cooked. That's like I said, you reduce the heat of your gas, not totally, or else it won't be. It won't be cooked. For you to know that it's cooked, when you want to flip it, it when it brown, not burn. You flip it. This one is kind of bomb. Crazy bean. This oil was so hot. Too much. It was, it was so hot before when I put this. Am I making a mess already? I want my cara to be neat, please. So you just flip on. For this video not to be too long, when I want to start the second day, bag I will put it. The second bag, guys, I think it's going to be up to like third or fourth and a half bag today. It's quite a lot. I said go for the option. Then the turn is not bad, but I think I took a lot from this. Yeah, but everything is not going to fit in. So far, so good, guys. See what? So when a car is brown, that's when you know that. So the last one will be so the up to four five minutes. It was two and a half bags. Not, not that bad. Not that bad guys. <coughs> I'm a little bit tired because I want it to go quickly. I'm starving, man. You know, I told you earlier on that it took me time to, to wash the, the beans. 
taking on the the candle or the skin. It took me time. I hate doing that. But if I knew, I should have washed it a night before the morning I want to make the bits. I should have. Nevertheless, it's all almost ready, so I don't have to complain. Just have to enjoy my breakfast. Okay, guys, let's make our akam. I bought this akam from Africa Shop. It's my first time of buying akam there. I have custard, guys. I have custard. I have custard that's not even open, but to enjoy the akara today. I want to enjoy it with my local akami. So I hope it turned out good. Because it's my first time. I didn't get it with this container. This container is for ships, but I turned it into a container for it to be more safer. So do you enjoy making akami? I'm making akami it's like a child love. <laughs> it's like playing a try a lot. I hate to cook my camu back in the oven, in the microwave. I want it to be well cooked once when I'm putting the hot water. I don't like after putting the hot water when it's not well taped, then I put it in the microwave. But it does happen like that a lot because, like I said earlier on, it's like a, a try and lock. It is like a try and lock. Sometimes it works well. So I like my camo to be thick like this when making it. Let's see. Oh. You see that? Oh, I don't want to put it in my clothes anymore. It's cooked. Maybe I'll just put it for two minutes. It's not thick enough for me. I love thick cacao. So if I was using powder milk, this the way it thick now would be okay. But I'm not using powder milk. I'm using a uh, evaporated milk. So it's going to make it more watery. Anyways, let's. So guys, enjoy my breakfast with me. It's ready. If you are new to my channel, guys, and you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for, guys? Please do subscribe, share, and hit the notification button. So whenever I post a new video, you will be the first to see it and watch it. Love you all. Have a nice weekend. Continue to hit the notification button as I said earlier. Bye for now.